morning, everyone. Good morning. So we are at the Louvre Museum, as you can see right here. It's a nice morning. Chilly too. Rained a little bit. A little bit. So we're gonna go check out some artwork. So let's go. As you can see right there, that's, there's the Louvre Pyramid and some architecture right there. I'm really amazed. Look at all the pillars, the statues, and the roof right there. I definitely love all the architecture in Paris. It, I can just admire this all day. So our ticket time to go in is at 10.30, so we're just waiting around for a bit. What time is it now? It's only 10 of 7. 10 of 7? Okay, we got 23 more minutes. So. A lot of architecture here. And now we're gonna go see the Mona Lisa. IPAs, the 50 size, always got to get the 50 size. 50 size means pint. Cheers. Cheers. It's nice and sweet. Pretty hoppy, but not too hoppy. There's a hint of sweetness to it. I really like this IPA. All right, for my order, I got the duck confit right here with the potatoes. And then you got the beef tartare with fries. Onion, cilantro, very meaty, hearty, tastes very good. We'll add some of this. Ketchup and mayo. Mmm. Rising into my Dunk Hot Beat. Mm -hmm. Oh, look how tender it is. It's really tender. Like, it just slices right through it. Oh wow, this is very flavorful, very tender. It like literally falls off the bone. This is so good. The skin is like very fatty, has a nice crispiness to it. Yeah, this is really good duck con beef. Yes. Yeah. yeah, it is really good. And also a pro tip, get the beef tartare and just put it on top of the baguette that comes with the side. It's the best. <laughs> And as you can see right here, Paris is getting ready for the Olympics next year. There are the Olympic rings. And here we are, Notre Dame de Paris. Um, as you can see, it's still not open ever since the fire and it's still under construction. But it is really cool to see all the Gothic architecture and all the stones that were made to build Notre Dame. Yeah, it's a sight to see. It. We got this wooden seats right here, just watching Notre Dame from here. This is where all the cathedral windows at, and then all the little statues lining up at the bottom. And as you can see right there, that's where all the gargoyles is at. And as we were admiring Notre Dame, uh, Katie mentioned that there's hidden Mickeys on this uh, cathedral. <laughs> and then right over there, more gargoyles. But had those huge cranes. Crazy how tall they are. But yeah, they're helping rebuild Notre Dame right now. Hopefully when we could come back, we could go into Notre Dame and see the cathedral itself. So we just discussed 
discovered this ramen place randomly on Google. It's not too far from our hotel. Got this sake? Yep. Uh, which sake is this one? This is a uh, Mizu no something. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's just go with it. It's from Fukushima. Okay, cool. let's try it. Two different decisions or one view. Alright, cheers. Mm. This might be a bigger or a little bit. Mm. Mm. Not bad. Yeah. Smooth. Yeah, I like it. It's very smooth and sweet. Looks like for starters, we got the tuna right here. Tastes just like a tuna salad. And it has a bit of potato to it. And mayonnaise. It's good. For appetizers, we got the gyoza right here. It's the chicken one. A little hot carbonara. Pretty good. It's fresh. Freshly made chicken. It is steamy hot. You can taste the chicken, the, the onions, the flavors. It's really good. Alright, we got the shoyu chicken ramen right here. Mm -hmm. We got yours. I got the same one too. That's good. Wanna try it? Yeah. Oh, it's very thin, light. Definitely tastes like the chicken. It has like a, a strong shoyu flavor. I have a lot of vegetables, so. Chicken shoyu is it's actually really good. It's not dry, it's good. I mean, not like, not like Hainan chicken, but like, it's a different take on it. It's kind of like good. Cheers. Yeah, the shoyu broth is pretty light. Chicken chashu is really good. Very tender, not dry. I like the texture to the ramen. Very soft. It's really good. 